Good morning, dear students. So, in this class, we will be discussing about thermodynamics of mixing for non ideal solutions. We have seen thermodynamics of mixing for ideal solutions. What we had discussed during thermodynamics of mixing in the previous class was that of ideal solution. Now, let's see how the thermodynamics of mixing parameters are derived for non ideal solutions. Consider that we are mixing two pure liquids, two pure liquids, one and two, and the free energy, uh, we, and we are going to find out the change in free energy on mixing of these solutions. Delta G mix, as we have already um, discussed, is equal to G final minus G initial. In this case, what is G initial? It is the uh, free energy of the pure liquids before they are mixed. Therefore, G initial can be written as N1 mu1. It's not mu1, it's mu1 zero because these are pure liquids. We can write N1 mu1 zero plus N2 mu2 zero. This is the free energy of the uh, two liquids before mixing. This can be written as sigma Ni mu i zero. Okay, what is mu i zero here? It is the chemical potential of the pure liquid. The free energy change on mixing G final is equal to N1 mu1 plus N2 mu2. Same as that we derived that we discussed during thermodynamics of mixing of ideal solutions. Okay, here, uh, sorry, N1 mu1 into mu2. This can be written as sigma ni mu i. Okay. So, what is mu i? It is the chemical potential of the component i in solution. Mu i is equal to mu i 0 plus rt ln. Here, since these are non-ideal solutions, we can write it as a i. Therefore, g final can now be written as sigma n i into mu i 0 plus r t l n a i. This can be written as sigma n i mu i 0 plus n i r t whole sigma n i r t l n a i. Now, let us see what delta g mix is. Delta g mix is equal to g final is sigma Ni mu i 0 and I am splitting it plus sigma Ni RT ln Ai minus sigma Ni mu i 0. Sigma Ni mu i 0 and minus sigma Ni mu i 0 cancel out and what is left is delta G mix delta G mix is equal to um, since the mixing is at constant temperature, uh, we can take R outside, R, RT outside, RT, sigma, Ni, Ln, A. This is the free energy change on mixing of two solution, two liquids to produce a non-ideal solution. So we know that Ai is equal to gamma into Xi. So, we can substitute it. Therefore, delta G mixing will be equal to RT sigma Ni ln gamma I Xi. So, Ai is gamma I Xi. Therefore, this is RT into sigma Ni ln gamma I plus RT into sigma Ni ln Xi. This is delta G mix for two liquids, uh, 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 delta G mixing or formation of a non-ideal solution. Okay, this is the free energy change on mixing. Now, let's see what is delta S mix. Uh, like in the case of uh, ideal solution, delta S mix can be derived by considering minus Dou delta G mix by dou T at one 
capacitant and pressure. This can be written as minus rho by rho t substitute for delta G mix RT sigma ni ln a i. Here R is the constant. We can take it outside. Minus R do by do t of we have t and a both of which are um, variables here and since we are differentiating with respect to t t is a variable and a is a function of t and hence activity is a function of t and hence a is also a variable so we can uh, differentiate it using the product rule uh, d by dt of t into sigma ni ln ai this is equal to minus r into first function into differential of the second that is t into differential of the second now becomes sigma ni do ln ai by do t do t it will be at constant pressure plus second function into uh, that is sigma ni ln ai into differential of the first is 1 Okay, so what do we have now? Delta S mix is equal to minus R sigma Ni ln Ai minus Rt sigma Ni dou ln Ai by dou T at constant pressure. Uh, since this term does not have a differential, uh, that's why I wrote it first. Delta S mix is equal to minus R sigma Ni ln Ai minus Rt sigma Ni dou ln Ai by dou T at constant pressure. Now we have an expression for delta S mixing on the formation of a non-ideal solution. Now let's see what delta H mixing will be. Delta H mixing will be equal to delta G mixing plus T into delta s mixing okay so what is delta g mixing delta g mixing is equal to uh, we have obtained it as equal to sigma sorry r r t r t sigma n i l n a i plus t into Delta S mix we obtained it as equal to minus R sigma Ni ln Ai plus uh, no, minus Rt sigma Ni dou ln Ai by dou T at constant pressure. Rewriting it we can write Rt sigma Ni ln Ai minus Rt Sigma Ni ln Ai minus Rt squared Sigma Ni dou ln Ai by dou T at constant pressure. These two terms cancel out and what we have left here is delta H mix is equal to minus Rt squared Sigma Ni dou ln Ai by dou T at constant this is the expression for delta H mix. Okay. Now what is AI? AI is equal to sigma I into Xi. Therefore, what is ln AI? That is equal to ln sigma I plus ln Xi. So what is do ln AI by dou T at constant pressure? This will be equal to dou ln gamma i by dou t at constant pressure plus dou ln xi by dou t at constant pressure. What is xi? Xi is the mole fraction. Is it dependent on temperature? No, mole fraction does not depend on temperature. Therefore, this term is equal to 0. So, what is dou ln ai by dou t at constant pressure? It is equal to do ln gamma i by do t constant. Therefore, delta H mix can also be written as equal to minus R t squared sigma ni do ln 
gamma i by dou t at constant pressure. In some textbooks, you will uh, see delta H mixing as equal to minus R T squared sigma i dou ln x uh, gamma i by dou t at constant pressure. So uh, then you must not wonder why A i has been replaced by uh, gamma i rather than gamma i into x, uh, the reason being uh, x i or, or the mole fraction is independent of temperature hence differential of that term becomes equal to C. Okay. Now we have uh, delta V mix. We have to derive the expression for delta V mix. What is delta V mix? That is rho delta G mix by rho P at constant temperature. That will be equal to rho by rho P. Of what is delta G mix? Sigma Ni RT ln Ai. Okay. Uh, set constant temperature. This can be written as equal to RT um, RT sigma Ni dou ln Ai by dou P at constant temperature. This is the expression for delta V mix. Now we have the expressions for delta V mix, delta H mix, delta S mix, and delta G mix. The free energy change on mixing of two liquids to form non-ideal solutions. This is the thermodynamics of mixing of uh, two liquids to keep a non-ideal solution. Thank you.